Um, how do we get people to perform better? You know, at work, they need you to pay attention to them. They need you to, to acknowledge them. They need to be doing meaningful and purposeful work. And they need some autonomy. They need some autonomy. And if those ingredients are in place, people will perform better. But you know what, for it to work, it goes back to relationship. The relationship piece must be there. You must have a relationship, a, a positive relationship with your people. Like you need to have a positive relationship, positive relationships with our children. So you need to know your people, you need to have a relationship with them. I used to tell the kids, that, uh, the staff, I said, listen, I had three uh, things in my office on the wall. I didn't spend a lot of time in my office, by the way. I was very visible around the school, but you walked in. There was a, 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 a picture. I'll be done right now, right? I'm done. Uh, there'll be a goalie mask. There's a, there's a goalie mask there, a picture of a goalie mask. And then the second symbol is a mom holding a baby. And the third was Terry Fox banner. And I said, as a teacher, your job is to get to know the children. They come to school wearing a mask. And it's, it's the same thing with the people you're supervising. They come to work wearing a mask. You need to get to know them. And if you don't spend time with them and have the relationship, good luck. And I said, you know, must also demonstrate and communicate your care. People don't care what you say until you care about them. And then once you get to know them, you demonstrate, communicate your care, you'll inspire them the way Terry Fox inspires us every, every fall to walk to earn money for uh, cancer research. That's the answer to your question. Thank you. Sorry about that.